I C N I C This looks like just the spot for our picnic. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's great to be outdoors. We should run around a bit and get some exercise. I want to eat, then have a nap. I certainly don't want to run around. Maybe Daddy should run around a bit. His tummy is quite big. My tummy is not big. But later I will get some exercise, even if no one else does. <laughs> Let's eat. Good idea, Mummy Pig. I'm really hungry. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, I feel quite sleepy. I thought you wanted to run around a bit, Daddy Pig. So much for Daddy Pig and his exercise. <laughs> uh, what? You lot again? Peppa told you, there's no more bread. Mummy, we do have strawberry cake. Well, if there's any cake left over, you can give it to the ducks. <laughs> Everyone likes Mummy Pig's homemade <laughs> strawberry cake. E G G S Your friends have been eating my vegetables again. Which friends? Tom, Dick and Harry. <coughs> Those aren't their names. Granny Pig has chickens. <coughs> wow. Say hello to Jemima, Sarah and Vanessa. Hello. <coughs> and here is Neville. <coughs> is Neville a boy chicken? Yes, Pepper. He's a cockerel. <coughs> He's the worst, scratching up my vegetables. Neville wouldn't hurt a fly. I've seen him eat flies. Yeah. And he ate my lettuce. You don't want to eat Grandpa's lettuce, do you? <coughs> Not when there's lovely corn to eat. <coughs> Come on, this way home. <coughs> Peppa, George, would you like to feed corn to the chickens? Yes, please, Granny. <coughs> Here you are, chickens. Eat up. <coughs> Ooh, you've got a Wendy house. That's the chicken coop. It's where the chickens lay their eggs. Eggs? I can't see any eggs. Not now, but there will be eggs soon. Ooh! It is bedtime for Pepper and George at Granny and Grandpa's house. <laughs> <laughs> Have the chickens laid their eggs yet, Granny? Maybe in the morning, Pepper. How will we know when it's morning? Neville will tell us. Now, go to sleep. Night, night. It is morning. It's Neville! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for waking us up, Neville. <laughs> Good morning, Jemima, Sarah and Vanessa. Do you have any eggs for us? One, two, three, four. Four eggs, Granny. Now we'll have eggs for breakfast. Thank you, Jemima, Sarah and Vanessa. <laughs> <laughs> Boiled eggs for everyone. Hooray! Mmm, delicious. <coughs> Granny, your chickens make yummy eggs. Yes. It's all that lovely corn they eat. And my lettuces. B-R-E-A-D <laughs> 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 Maybe 
there on holiday. Let's have our picnic lunch. <laughs> the ducks always turn up when, when we have picnics. <laughs> Peppa and George love picnics. <laughs> Look, it's the ducks. <laughs> Stop, Daddy. We need bread for the ducks. <laughs> All right. Hello, Mrs. Duck. Here come more ducks. All our brothers and sisters are here. And here come more ducks. It's the Granny and Grandpa ducks. And here are all the aunties and uncles. <laughs> oh, oh, that's the last of our picnic gone. Ducks, say thank you to Daddy Pig. Ho, oh, oh, ho, you're most welcome. <laughs> I love Duckland. <laughs> It is time to go home. I wonder what's the shortest way home. Drive straight ahead into the river. Oh, are you sure? Yes, drive into the river. But we can't drive in the river. Yes, it's talking nonsense. Please press the blue button. <laughs> Camper van is driving into the river. <laughs> <laughs> Our camper van has turned into a boat. I wasn't quite expecting that. Welcome to the car of the future. Look, it's Grandad Dog and Danny Dog. Ahoy there, Daddy Pig. <coughs> uh, ahoy there. Beep, beep. Sailing on the river. <laughs> Drive up the next hill. You have reached your destination. We're, We're home. home. Today is a day for pancakes. Pancakes? Delicious. <laughs> I love pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone loves pancakes. I'm the expert at flipping the pancakes over. Leave that to me. Are you sure, Daddy Pig? Last time you got a bit grumpy when you dropped the pancake on the floor. I did not get grumpy. There was a problem with the frying pan. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy, can we help make the pancakes, please? <coughs> yes, you can help me make the batter. <coughs> First, I put some flour in the bowl. Ooh. Now I add an egg. Now the milk. And I give it all a stir. <coughs> Mummy, can I stir? Yes, of course, Peppa. Peppa loves stirring. George wants to stir as well. <laughs> no, George, like this. <laughs> OK, that's enough stirring. You two sit at the table while I cook the pancakes. <laughs> Mummy Pig is going to flip the pancake over. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> you could flip it higher, Mummy Pig. You can show us how when you flip your own pancake, Daddy Pig. This first pancake is for George. Mummy Pig pours a little syrup on George's pancake. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> this pancake is for Pepper. <laughs> mm, you could flip it higher, Mummy Pig. You will get a chance to show me when you flip your own pancake, Daddy Pig. <laughs> Syrup, please. Mmm, delicious. <laughs> S.
first, we have to wash them. Pepper and George help Granny Pig wash the vegetables. <laughs> Maybe that's enough washing. Granny Pig has made the tomatoes, lettuce and cucumber into a salad. Grandpa Pig, can you call everyone to lunch? Lunch! <laughs> Granny Pig has made pizza for lunch. And here's some salad made with Grandpa's tomatoes, lettuce and cucumber. Chuck in, everyone. <laughs> George has eaten his pizza, but George does not like the tomatoes or the lettuce or the cucumber. Oh, dear, George. Don't you like the salad? No. George, just try a little bit of this lovely tomato. Yuck. George... This is cucumber. Grandpa Pig grew it in his garden. Yeah. Try a piece of lettuce, George. It's yummy. <coughs> oh, now, now, George. <coughs> Look what I'm doing. Now it's a dinosaur. A dinosaur. <laughs> <coughs> George loves dinosaurs. George is eating the tomatoes, lettuce and cucumber. Well done, George. Would you like some more, George? Full. George, are you too full to eat any more tomatoes, lettuce or cucumber? George is too full to eat any more. George, are you too full to eat anything more? George is too full to eat anything more. Oh, well. Then you won't want any of this chocolate cake. Chocolate cake! <laughs> My word! George seems to have got his appetite back. like to plant a strawberry seed? Yes, please. This seed will grow into a lovely strawberry plant. First, make a little hole. Then I put the seed in and cover it with earth. Shall I water it for you? No, no. I want to water it. Good. Now we wait for it to grow. Pepper and George are waiting for the seed to grow. It's not doing anything. <laughs> You'll have to be patient, Pepper. It will take a long time to grow. Pepper, George, it's time to go home. But we're waiting for my strawberry plant to grow. <laughs> I wanted strawberries for tea. Don't worry, Pepper. Next time you come, the seed will have grown into a plant. I will have strawberries. Yes. Come on, Pepper. Bye bye, Grandpa. Bye bye, strawberry. <laughs> <laughs> Grandpa Pig looks after Pepper's strawberry plant. After many days, Grandpa Pig finds a tiny plant growing. Day by day, the plant grows bigger and bigger. Then one day, Grandpa Pig finds something very special. Strawberries! Grandpa, we're back! Pepper and George have come to play again. Grandpa, Grandpa, did my plant grow? Yes! Look! Ooh! Strawberries! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Grandpa. F 
A U I T Look, it's Mr. Potato. Mrs. Carrot. Sweet cranberry and little sprouts. <laughs> <laughs> Apple, apple, orange, banana, banana pear and pineapple too Eat five pieces of fruit a day because they're good for you <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Fruit Day, where the magic of fruit never ends Wow, so much fruit Hello, Hello Peppa. Peppa Hello We are choosing our favourite fruit What's your favourite? Um, I like apples. I like oranges. I like bananas. I like carrots. Carrots are not a fruit. Oh, carrots are a vegetable. <coughs> Edmund is a bit of a clever clogs. What's your favourite fruit, George? <coughs> is it bananas or oranges? George likes strawberries the best. Strawberry. George loves strawberries. Smoothies! Get your fruit smoothies here! <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Miss Rabbit! What's a fruit smoothie? It's a drink made from fruit. Would you like one? Yes, please. Can I have a smoothie with apples? OK, but smoothies can have lots of different fruit in them. OK, apples, raspberries, Bananas and more apples! An apple, raspberry, banana and more apples smoothie. Mmm, delicious! Can I have a smoothie, please? Me too! And me! And me! Of course! What fruit would you like in your smoothies? Uh, I don't know. It can be anything, Pedro. OK. Cheese, please. Pedro, cheese isn't a fruit. It has to be fruit or vegetables. OK, raspberries and blueberries and blackberries and gooseberries. That's more like it. Raspberry and blueberry and blackberry and gooseberry smoothies for everyone. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> found a beautiful Princess Pepper <laughs> and Sir George, the brave knight. <laughs> and a cook who makes the most delicious food ever. <laughs> Mummy Pig, Daddy Pig and Grandpa Pig are waiting to eat dinner. I'll go and see what's keeping Granny Pig. What's next in the story? Naughty Granny Pig, you woke the little ones. He promised to sleep. When the story ends, Grandpa. I'm good at ending stories, Granny Pig. You go downstairs. I won't be long. There's a boy, a beanstalk, a beautiful princess, a brave knight, and a cook who makes a lovely dinner. Well, after they ate the lovely dinner, everyone fell asleep. The end. Then they all woke up. And along came a wizard. A wizard? Yes, a wizard. We're going to do a big magic show. Ah, uh, but... Then along came a scary dragon. <laughs> <laughs> Granny Pig, Mummy Pig and Daddy Pig are still waiting to eat dinner. <laughs> that bedtime story doesn't seem to be working. I'm the expert at telling bedtime stories. I'll have them asleep in no time. Ah, a scary dragon! <laughs> Pepper, George, back to bed. But Grandpa hasn't finished the story yet, Daddy. I'll finish the story. I'll be down in a minute. <laughs> OK. There's a boy, a beanstalk, a castle, a beautiful princess, a brave knight, a cook, a wizard and a scary dragon. And a very hungry king. 
So they all had a big dinner and lived happily ever after. The end. Then they had the party. And all their friends came. <laughs> <laughs> Right, I think I'd better sort this out. C O O K I E S George wants to play with Pepper. He feels a bit lonely. George, I need some help. I'm making chocolate chip cookies. Someone needs to lick out the bowl. <laughs> George likes helping Mummy make cookies. But he likes playing with Pepper more. I want to be a nurse. I want to be a doctor. But who's going to be the sick person? George! <laughs> Peppa and Susie love playing doctors and nurses. So does George. Peppa listens to George's chest. Now, George, take a big breath in, then cough. <gasps> hmm. I think your heart's a bit loose. Help with a plaster on it. <laughs> Open wide, please. Susie takes George's temperature. Oh dear, you're very, very hot. I think you have to stay in bed for three years. <laughs> Daddy Pig has come to find George. Oh no, what's wrong with George? Don't worry, Daddy, it's only a game. George is our patient. Oh, I see. Can the patient have a visitor? Just for a little while. He might get tired. Cookies! Yes, they're for George. They're his medicine to make him feel better. <laughs> um, excuse me, Doctor. Can you help me? I have a sore tummy. <laughs> that tickles. <laughs> I can hear him rumbling. I think you're hungry, Daddy. <laughs> then I think I need lots of cookies to make me better. <laughs> <laughs> and me. And me. And me. <laughs> 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 Good morning, George. Are you ready for breakfast? We're having cereal. Good morning, Mummy Pig. Can we have pancakes today? Oh, I don't think we have the right ingredients for pancakes. Please, please, can we have pancakes? Begged Pepper. OK, we'll have to check the fridge and see what we have. <gasps> Thanks, Mummy Pig! Yay! Sounds like Peppa's very excited. Hmm, what do we have in the fridge? Oh dear, not the right ingredients at all. We're going to have to write a shopping list, Peppa, and go shopping, advised Mummy Pig. Here's our shopping list. Let's write down what we need. Firstly, there's two pints of milk, four eggs, one flour. Oh, Mummy Pig, you've spelt flour wrong. Oh, silly me. That's flour. OK, now let's go shopping. Mummy Pig, Pepper, and George head to the supermarket. Danny Dog is at the checkout. Thanks, Candy Cat, for helping me with my shopping. Oh, it's a pleasure, Danny Dog. Enjoy the pasta. Meow. Bye. Woof. Bye. Meow. Oh, look. Here's Mummy Pig with her shopping trolley. Now, Peppa, we need to find all the ingredients for the pancakes. OK, Mummy Pig. 
I'll go and find them. What shall we get first, George? Why don't you try and find the milk first? Said Mummy Pig. Okay, Mummy Pig. Okay, George, you can help too. Now, where's the milk? Chop, 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 chop. Oh, look! Here it is, Mummy Pig. I found the milk. Well done, Pepper. Praised Mummy Pig. I've got two pints of milk. Yay! I found the milk. Into the trolley goes the milk. Let's cross it off Mummy Pig's shopping list. I'll go and get the eggs now, Mummy Pig. Okay, Pepper. I found the Mummy Pig. Gosh, that was quick. Put them in the basket then, and I'll cross them off the list too. <laughs> now let's find George. Doop doop. George, George, George has gone to look for the flower. George, have you found the flower? Oh, well done, George. Let's put it in the basket. Into the trolley goes the flower. Let's cross it off Mummy Pig shopping list. Now we need to go to the checkout and pay for the ingredients. Hello, Candy Cat. Oh, hello, Mummy Pig. Hello, Peppa. Hello, George. What are you making today? We're making pancakes. Oh, I love pancakes too. I want to make blueberry pancakes, Mummy Pig. Well, we better get home and make some then, George. Bye, Candy Cat. Mummy Pig. Peppa Pig and George are back home with their shopping. There's milk, flour, eggs, blueberries. These pancakes are going to be delicious. Mummy Pig, I'm so excited to make pancakes. I can't wait. Right, so now we need to add all the ingredients to the mixing bowl. Who wants to help? Okie doke. I've got the flour. Okay, let's put it in then, Pepper. I'm so excited. In goes the flour. Whoosh. Well, next, George, we should add the milk. Do you want to do it? Glug, glug, glug. Now we have to put in the eggs. Do you have them, Pepper? Here they are. In it goes. Well done, Peppa. Now what do we do, Mummy Pig? Now we have to stir all the ingredients together. We don't want lumpy pancakes, do we? Yeah. No. Now it's time to cook them in the pan. Mummy Pig better do this bit because it's very hot. Let's pour in the mixture. Sizzle, 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 sizzle. Do you think we should toss the pancakes? Oh, yes, Mummy Pig, please. One, two, three. Oh no, the pancake has landed on George's head. <laughs> Are you okay, George? <coughs> well, we should probably put it on a plate first, George. Hmm? <laughs> Don't the pancakes look delicious? There's maple syrup and George has a blueberry one. <gasps> wow, who wants some maple syrup? Oh yes, please, Mummy Pig. I'm going to pour some on now. Swoosh. These are delicious. Oh, my piglets. <laughs> <laughs> ¶¶